so when you get chips in they all have these uh, slightly angled legs so they come in these tubes which I get in thousands a month for all the Harlequin kits uh, so this uh, tool which I just finished uh, 3d printed with several parts which you can ad actually adjust slightly so you can uh, put the um, ball bearing uh, slightly closer to this part here or this part so this is for two kinds of chips the, the white ones and the small ones and I will just show you what happens this is super simple it doesn't cost you any, any strength and the pins come out just perfect this is just an awesome invention uh, I have to congratulate the person who came with the ID which I found on uh, some website where you can download all kinds of STL files so this is just perfect um, really speeds up the process a lot it's a lot faster than uh, what i did in, uh, in the past with uh, this old one here which is uh, painful for your thumbs after a while and if you get in this many chips and uh, this is just so much more easy um just have to check if nothing happens to pins so this is a, a perfect invention from someone and i think it's it's an old way of bending the legs because i saw some aluminium tools uh, which looked like this but um, this is of course 3d printed now and it's just works like a charm so if you have a 3d printer and you need to do this yourself a lot grab the, uh, the files from thingiverse and make one yourself